Praise the Lord, everybody. I am so grateful and thankful to have all of you here with us in our 116th Holy Convocation. Today is consecration services. So we are so delighted that you have taken out your Saturday afternoon, your Saturday morning to come and be with us. Listen, I have a jewel with me on this afternoon. She's everybody's auntie. She's everybody's auntie. And I am talking about none other than Dr. Dorinda Clark. Cole, Auntie, how are you this morning? I am wonderful. Thank God I woke up this morning with my mind stayed on Jesus. Listen, she says she's Ooh, toured out. You're, you're... I am so toured out. I'm toured lagged. Listen, I'm just I'm just so glad to be a coach so that we can get away from Listen, the tour. Auntie, all over the country, all over the country, we yes. have been so proud mm, to see you, you and the thank Clark you. sisters, our first lady, yes. and Auntie Jackie and Auntie yes. Twinkie. We were Kojic proud. We yes. were standing up in coliseums all over the country Ooh. saying that they belong to us. Yes. And we even had my little sister Kiera yes. on tour with you this time. It, it was, was absolutely wonderful and it was amazing to see that we could spread the gospel of Jesus Christ through song. I love it. And, um, and I was just saying to you about how Kurt uh, Franklin wanted the Clarks to come back the second time. That's why we went did that 30 city tour and I'm tired <laughs> he wanted us to come back the second time because we got such a great response yeah. from all of the people um, that were there yes, and so they said no we got to get the clock season back they were yeah. emailing and I'm telling but let me tell you, you it was oh God was so gracious to us and he gave us the grace yes, to continue the 30 city tour I love it 30. I and this is the thing you come off of tour and you've been in this meeting every night we've yes. seen you shine we've seen you looking pretty Ooh. and you holding it down auntie uh, we want you to help us this morning uh, listen it is my favor? privilege and my honor <laughs> <laughs> to help us this morning and yes. let's uh, talk to the people of god about giving and why it's important to give to the kojic kojic is the place where we get, know that it's fertile ground um, the reason why is because you see all of us that have come each night to come to you and we know that you couldn't get here but however you are here watching us yes. now and we don't want you to leave your set or we don't want you to leave your phone your computer because we got some good news for you and the good news is that when you give yes, Kojic does I love it. let me tell you um, um, pastor I know that um pastor I'm prophesying here, you know. <laughs> but let me tell you, Elder Terrell, I, I, I watched God do yes, some awesome things through my life. Yes, ma'am. Um, and God woke me up this morning, and he said to me that this is the hour for entrepreneurs and businesses. Yes, ma'am. I know we had the election just a few days ago, and I told the people last night when I was raising the offering last night, I said, you know, it's amazing how God has never forgot about us. Yes, you know, He, the Bible says that... I I've seen the righteous forsaken, nor his seed beg for bread. And God is not going to ever put us in the place where we can't pay our bills, where we can't provide for our families, where we can't make sure that our children are taken care of. God opens up those doors and allow us to be able to give to ministry, and yes, God sir. blesses us. I'm going to tell you the honest God truth. I was sitting in the service with you mm -hmm. when you were conducting offering. This is back home in Detroit. Mm -hmm. And you said, if you give, and, and I won't try to uh, fluff it up, I can't remember the amount mm -hmm. but what you ask us to give they said you said when you give somebody's gonna bless your cash app oh yes. right now yes. i'm serious and yes. i got up and ken and i my wife was with me mm -hmm. me and candace laughing and you said somebody's gonna bless your cash app right mm -hmm. now and me and Candace are sitting there, and I got my cash app open. Wow. After I gave, I'm saying, I'm laughing with my wife. I said, no, the woman of God said it. She better be right. I said, she better be, and I promise you on everything. Me and Candace say, laugh about this to this day. Yeah. Right then, while my cash app was open, somebody blessed my cash oh, app my right God. then. And this is the honest God truth. Yes. I was amazed, wow. and we should never be shocked, right, mm. when the woman and man of God speak to us. To us. And, but we should be prepared, yes. standing in anticipation Absolutely. that it's going to happen when you give by faith. And yes. so I just believe, uh, Dr. Cole, I'm going to ask you to uh, 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 give us what the Lord is giving for you yes. to uh, challenge us to give yes. this morning. Absolutely. And I just believe you're a woman of faith. And yes. I believe you're a woman that 
it hears from God. And when we do it, I believe God is going to show up. Yes, absolutely. And let me tell you, I want to share. I don't know who I'm talking to right in this camera right now, but I want to tell you that once you are obedient to God, when the man and the woman of God tell you to give, you already know what he did before. Yes, and he's well able to do it again. I don't know who's, who's, who I'm talking to. There might be a mother, a single mother, saying, I don't know how I'm going to get my child's tuition paid. But I promise you, if you connect with us today, uh, just as you've heard Elder McCoy say, that God will bless your cash app, I'm here to tell you, he will do just that. You got to trust God. I don't care what anybody say. I know when God brings a check in the mail. And sometimes it's unexpected, and that's what he's going to do for you. I want to challenge every one of you that are listening to Mr. Dorinda right now on a three-level offering. And that three-level offering is those of you that can give $100, if you can give $50, or if you can give $30. Whatever that level is, you may say, well, Sister Dorinda, I cannot give the 100 I don't have it. Give the very best you can. And when you give it, you know what I want you to say? This is the word you're going to say. I trust in God. That's yeah. what you're going to say. I, love I it. trust in God. No matter what it looks like, no matter what the enemy has said to you, no matter what the newscaster has said to it. you, I trust in God. That's what I want you. I want to see you tag that line. All I want to make sure that you get what I'm saying. When you give that hundred dollar seat, the minute it leaves your um, your credit card, the minute it leaves your your cell phone, or you type it in, that's when God is going to step in. I promise you. If you do it, you'll see that the overflow blessings are coming to your way. But businesses and entrepreneurs. I love it, Auntie. Businesses I'm a and business entrepreneurs. Man. I'm an entrepreneur. I'm yes. giving. I hope you give as well. Yes. Dr. Cole, I love you. Love you. Thank I thank you, you so God much. I you appreciate you. you. Sit right there. I'm going to take you back. Don't uh -uh, walk on I'm your own. Y'all <laughs> keep on giving here. <laughs> I got two journeys.